A Vancouver woman says that she caught something disturbing on her home security video. And the thing is, she thinks that it could be tied to a larger investigation in Clark County. You may remember we told you about this, where cats and raccoons are apparently being intentionally poisoned. So there's cause for concern. And Fox 12's Kelsey Watts is live tonight with this update. Kelsey? Well, a couple of days ago, Donna Larson woke up to find a bag of cat food out in the driveway in front of her complex right here. So she went back to look at her video system, and here's what she saw. Just before 3 a.m. Monday morning, some raccoons slip under her garage door, which was left open a crack, and they drag a bag of her cat food out into the street. A driver hits it, tearing the bag open, and then watch this. Someone wearing dark clothing walks over and clearly sprinkles something onto the food. Donna Larson believes it's poison because she says her video shows that after this happened, her cats wouldn't go near it. She turned the video over to Clark County Animal Control and they will be investigating, but they say it may be difficult to prove what happened since the bag and the cat food were cleaned up before investigators could take samples. Clark County Animal Control is already investigating several cases across the Vancouver area where cats and raccoons have apparently been intentionally poisoned or killed. They say it's happened in the Hauk neighborhood northwest of downtown, in the Fisher's Landing area in outer southeast Vancouver, and some raccoons were even killed and placed in Fircrest Park near I-205 in Mill Plain. Donna's home on Falk Road is within that area, but Clark County Animal Control says it has not gotten any reports of dead animals in her neighborhood. And right now they don't know whether this is connected. If someone was trying to intentionally harm animals again, Donna wants them to know that is not the solution. I really was hoping that none of the raccoons ate it, that no cats ate it. And I was also really concerned because the kids had touched the bag. I think that poison is just, from what I've heard, a horrible way to die. And it's not how you get rid of, of pests or raccoons. It's not what normal people do. And Clark County Animal Control says it is investigating every tip it receives, and it does have officers that will be following up. Live in Vancouver tonight, Kelsey Watts, Fox 12 Oregon.